quick video tutorial on how to use Google Calendar to set up individualized appointment slots for students for small um, meeting check-ins with students and how an automatically a Google Meet link can be generated when students claim that spot. So let's get started. So imagine that on you know this coming Friday on the 17th, I would like to have appointment meetings running from 10 to one o'clock and I'll give my students the opportunity to jump into those meetings individually. So I'm just going to create an event here in Google Calendar from 10 to one. And notice that I'm on the day view in Google Calendar. You have to be in either the day or week view in order to see this setting. So I'll go back to the day view, set that meeting back up 10 to one. So I will call this individual student check-ins. Now, instead of just creating the event right now, I'm going to select appointment slots. So from 10 to one appointment slot, and I can customize the duration. I'll have these run for 20 minutes each and save that event. Now that that's been created, if I click on the actual event in Google Calendar, notice there's an option to go to the appointment slot page. Here's the appointment slot page, and here's the link just for this one day on Friday 417. And notice there's these little buttons for individual student check-ins that they can go to. So what I'm gonna do is grab this URL and get that to my students. I can paste that in Google Classroom, maybe send them all an email, however you might do that. So I'm gonna push that URL over to a student device and then demonstrate the rest of the process. All right, so now you can see the student device. And this might be a student iPad where they click on the link and open up that appointment slot link that you've just pushed out. So here in the background is the event in Google Calendar that I've made as the teacher. And now here on the iPad is the student device and they can pick running from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m., whatever slot they'd like to grab. So in this instance, I'd like to grab the second slot right here for individual student check-in. And notice how it's pulling the name of the student automatically. The student can drop in some notes if they want to, or they can simply click save on this event. So now that event has been added. It will add to both the student calendar in Google Calendar tied to their Google account, and let's take a look to see what happens from the teacher perspective. If you'll notice here, from that 10 a.m. slot, there's a student, and there's the name of the student that took the 1020 slot right there. So now if I go into that event, and I'll go into editing mode to look at all the details, if you'll notice here, we have the teacher that created the event, the student that claimed that 1020 slot, and because there's a second participant in the event, Google automatically adds the link to the Google Meet. So now we just have to get the students used to going to Google Calendar to click on their individualized, unique Google Meet link to join the meeting. So I'll just save that event. So that's it. Google Calendar with Google appointment slots for individualized student check-in meetings. Good luck, and I hope this strategy works for you.